the customer journey, and I'm going to share a diagram here. Uh, the customer journey is a multi-step process that allows people to take audience members that are newer or that might be strangers at first and convert them as they take them uh, further, closer to the, the sale ladder. And so as you can see in the diagram, it starts off with attraction. And so no matter what you do, if you're a marketer or a coach or a business strategist or whatever, whatever your skill set is, start off conversations in Facebook groups, send out friend requests, and then connect on LinkedIn. So this is the initial attraction where you're just kind of building that buzz, building that crowd. So I need to do all three of those. Those are good ways to start. Okay. It's kind of in the okay. earlier stages. I know a lot of people might do one or two, but appreciate that. Okay, great. Yeah, so that, that's the way to start. And when you're doing this, this attraction, you need to make sure that you're focusing on pain points when you're creating content and what problem you solve. So I call these teacher industry posts. So if you're a marketer, teach marketing, show some case studies, teach some industry stuff, you know, include some statistics. But uh, it's very important that you're teaching your industry and you're doing something called proof of concept which means that you're showing people that you know your stuff. So the next step after you've attracted people is qualifying. And what this means is you want to align the right people for your tribe. And this is where a lot of people um, mess up their processes is that they'll just take anyone. You don't want to do that. You want to create that velvet rope, that exclusivity, and you want to make sure that this person uh, has the values that align with you. You don't want complainers. You don't want people with negative attitudes. You don't want people that are, you know, just going to bring down the, the worth of your network. 